Hi, everyone, and welcome to LearnBridge Online. I'm Marla Lawson, and we previously in a, another video looked at the Stamen Convention and some nuances with Stamen. So in this video, we're going to look at some practice hands and, and put it into practice. So let's see if I can launch this here. OK, partner has opened one no trump. And we have nine points, four, four, three, two shape, and we have a four card major. So here's a perfect case of using stamen. We'll bid two clubs. Asking partner, do you have a four card major? And yay, partner responds two spades. So we know that partner has four spades and they do not have four hearts, but we don't care about that because we don't have four hearts anyway. Okay, so we know we're playing in spades. With nine points, we have invitational values, so we can't insist on game. We're going to invite game by bidding three spades. And partner's passing, so they must have the minimum 15 points. Let's see. Okay. Yep. It looks like partner's got 15 points. And three spades has pretty good play. But we're probably going to lose a couple of diamonds and at least one heart. So that was probably a, a, play, a safe place to stop. Okay, let's look at another one. So here, now we're the, we're the opener. We've got 10 points. We don't have enough to open, so we'll pass. Partner opens one no trump. And once again, we can ask, do you have a four card major with stamen? Now this time they don't give us the response we're hoping for. They said two diamonds. So they don't have a four card major. We don't have a heart fit. So we're playing in no trump. We have 10 points. Partners got 15 to 17. So we know that combined we have at least 25. So we'll bid three no trump. We know the level, game, and we know the strain, no trump. OK, let's look at another example. So here again, partner has opened one no trump, and we've got 10 points. So we'll bid stamen. And they bid two hearts. Great, we have a heart fit. And with 10 points, do we have game? We sure do. So we'll bid the game. Okay, now things might get a little more complicated. Okay, so we are the dealer. We don't have enough to open, so we'll pass. And partner opens one no trump. And again, we got nine points and we got a four card major. So we'll ask, do you have a four card major? And they say, no, they don't. So this time we'll just invite and bid two no trump. And they'll pass. So they must have a minimum. Yeah, let's see. 15 points, 4432. Right. So they're at the minimum. So they'll decline our invitation and pass to no Trump. Okay. What about this one? Well, let's see. Now we are the ones to open one no trump. We have two four card majors, but four, four, three, two, 15 points, balanced hand, right? 15. And partner says two clubs, stamen. They're asking us, 
do you have a four card major? Well, we have both. The spades look a little nicer, but you always show the hearts first if you have both four card majors. And now we hear three no trump from partner. So what do we know about what's in partner's hand? Well, they're insisting on game, so they have at least 10 points. And they don't have four hearts because they picked no trump. So they must have four spades or they wouldn't have bothered with the statement convention. Now, they don't know that we also have four spades, but we know. So we can correct the game to four spades. And sure enough, now we can see partners got four spades. Great. See how easy this is? Okay, so now we have 10 points. And partner, ah, partner's overcalled one no trump. Well, we can do the same thing. We can use stamen and bid two clubs. But Marla, the opponent's opened one club. Isn't two clubs like a fancy cubid? No. When partner bids one no trump as an overcall, all systems are on, so two clubs is still stamen. And we have a spade fit. And we have 10 points. So bid the game in spades. All right. Now partners open two no trump. You know, we look at our hand, we've only got six points. We weren't too excited. But when partner opens two no trump showing to 20 to 21, we have a game for sure. 26, 27 points combined, absolutely. Let's check to see if we have a major suit fit. We can use stamen at this level too. We'll bid three clubs because two clubs would be insufficient. And we're in luck, partner answers three spades. So they have a spade fit with us and we'll bid the spade game. Here's another example. Okay, we have nine points. So not enough to open, guess what? Partners opening one no trump. And we have both four card, four card majors. So we can certainly use stamen. And they bid two diamonds. Okay, so they don't have a four card major. So we should bid like our hearts, right? No. We know partner doesn't have four hearts or four spades because they answered two diamonds. So the strain is no trump. We do not have a major suit fit. And we'll just invite with two no trump. Okay, and partner decides to go to three no trump. Well, hmm. I guess we just pass. We'll take, we'll, we'll assume that they know what they're doing. And now we'll get to see partner's hand. Yep, they've got like 17 points. So game looks pretty good. What about this example here? Again, we've got a four card major. We've got at least 10 points or nine points. Partner shows a hard fit and there it is. All righty. I 
I thought I had one other example in here. Here we go. So we've got a nine count. We'll wait and see what happens. And partner opens one no trump, but we're four triple three. So it's probably not worth it to you, Stamen. We'll just invite with two no trump. And they'll pass. And well, two no trump looks pretty good. Yeah, I think that'll that'll work out fine. One other thing I want to point out. So we open one no trump and partner bits two clubs and we show our four card spade suit and they invite with three spades. The level, the strain is set. We are playing in spades. This is not, the three spades is not an invitation. Oh, do you want to play three no trump or four spades? They're saying we're playing in spades, partner. You decide if we're playing three spades or four spades. So we have, let's see, 15 points. So we're at the bottom of our one no trump range and we will pass three spades. We're not going to correct a three no trump. Yes, we have a balanced hand, but we don't know about partner. And if I can show you all the cards, if you look at this, no Trump is doomed, right? Because right off the top, East West are gonna take four diamond tricks and four heart tricks. So three no Trump would be down four like instantly so you have to trust that when responder picks the strain that's the right strain unless of course they say no trump because they don't know we have a spade fit but my point is that when they invite with three hearts or three spades that is not an invitation oh pick no trump or the major they've said we're playing in the major and it's up to you to just pick if we're playing in game or not okay now that I've made your head spin, those are all my examples. But I hope that showed you some interesting nuances to the convention stamen, which is a little more complicated than you might think at first blush. And these are the kinds of questions that come up a lot in my class on Thursdays. And so I hope you'll check it out and join us sometime. Thanks a lot. Have fun playing bridge.